What's up guys, welcome to the Stack Street Sports Channel, I'm your host Jarrell Hicks, here to bring you a video on the possibility of Houston Texans trading Deshaun Watson to the Carolina Panthers. Let's get right into it. So the Carolina Panthers, who's been involved with every quarterback uh, trade possible this offseason, trying to get Derek Carr, trying to get Matthew Stafford, um, and a couple other names, they're going heavy on Deshaun Watson. Um, the Houston, Houston Texans are saying still, standing firm, they're not trying to trade them. But uh, as time goes on, as it closer to the NFL draft, they plan on they plan on applying pressure to the Texans organization to get Deshaun Watson. They just cut three very good players: Kawan Short, Trey Boston. I forgot the third name, which isn't that important. Whatever. They cut three guys, pretty good players, uh, with nice salaries to free up about twenty million dollars. Um, which gives them about thirty million dollars for in cap space in total to try to run make a run at, at Deshaun Watson. Uh, they have what the f number six pick, number seven pick. They have a top ten pick. I forgot which which pick exactly, but um, if they trade for Deshaun Watson, giving up a pick this year for certain that their first overall pick, well first round pick, and then next couple years picks, um, how would Deshaun Watson look on this team? And is a, a possibility of him coming here. I think it is. I think it is, man. We all know Ted Bridgewater is not the answer there. I don't know really why they even signed him. But, um, you know, you have good weapons there. Christian McCaffrey, DJ Moore, Robbie Anderson, who just signed last year from the Jets in free agency. Um, decent O-line. Not good, but it's pretty decent. It's, it's okay. Uh, the defense needs work as well. Brian Burns, Jeremy Chin, uh, rookie from last year, played well. Shaq Thomas. Is it Shaq Thomas or Shaq Thompson? Let me see. Linebacker. What was it? Shaq. Shaq Thompson. Excuse me. But, yeah. Uh, Gross Matos, defensive end. Defensive tackle, Derrick Brown. They have some pieces. Dante Jackson at cornerback. They have some pieces, man. So, it wouldn't be a bad team for them to go to. Um, going to the NFC South, my division, Atlanta Falcons fan, he could make some noise. They would be probably the second best team. Uh, you know, if even if Drew Brees is there, I would still have him second. Uh, and, and if Christian McCaffrey, Christian McCaffrey, excuse me, can stay healthy this season, um, yeah, they'll be a super dynamic duo. Watson, McCaffrey, um, Moore, Anderson, yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. That's similar to, you know, all that can equal up to him, uh, Watson and Houston having uh, DeAndre Hopkins again with uh, Robbie, uh, not Robbie Anderson, with uh, Fuller and those boys. That equals up to about the same type of weapons, you know. So um, that's not bad, man. I wouldn't mind seeing it happen. I think it would happen. Um, it's probably the best bet if he were to get traded. I know a lot of Eagles fans hoping, you know, they have Jalen Hurts now. They could swap Hurts with a couple picks and get Deshaun Watson. We'll see. We'll see. But I wouldn't mind seeing this move happen either. Uh, a new start for Watson. A new start for Teddy Bridgewater in in uh, in Houston. Get a bunch of picks, a bunch of weapons. Uh, a future quarterback somewhere in this draft for Houston. I'm thinking Kellen Mond, to be honestly, and to be honest, third round, fourth round, steal who I have at the steal of this draft. So we'll see what happens. I'm leaning toward this move happening. I will want to see it happen. Fresh start for the quarterback. But that's it for the video, guys. Leave in the comment section what you think should happen with Deshaun Watson. Should he stay? Should he go? What team? Let me know in the comment section down below. That's it for the video, guys. Like, share, comment, subscribe. I will see you guys next time.